Tech TV, Experience Educational Television. The Mathematics Department of the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology organized a seminar and quiz for seven senior high institutions in Kumase on the 18th of November 2017 at the College of Science Auditorium on the theme Beauty of Mathematics, Challenges and Opportunities. Speaking at the seminar were Reverend William Obeng Dente, the head of department. Mathematics is a branch of science. We deal with numbers, the operations, involving calculations, computations, solving problems, and a host of others. The actual meaning of mathematics is things which can be counted and the code. Now we can think that counting has a vital role in our daily life. Imagine that there are no mathematics at all. How would it be possible for us to count members of the family, number of students in the class? days in a week, months or years. On a basic level, we need to be able to count, add, subtract, multiply, and divide. My mother is an indispensable to in all human endeavors, and any patient that aspires to be great. The central position that my mother plays in all fields can be seen from science and technology, stock exchange, banking sector, medicine, weather forecast, SMEs, sports, economy, agriculture, economics, mathematics, education. In conclusion, I wish to state that the future of Ghana lies with science and technology with mathematics as the center. Mathematics is not a difficult subject. It only requires logical reasoning. We must adopt the right approach in teaching mathematics to learners. No patient is lost without mathematics. No fighting becomes rich without understanding numbers and finally, who have become so important if he or she has a strong and bad color now. Thank you. Professor Mrs. Atinuke Olusola Adibanji gave a presentation on the topic Challenges and Opportunities in Pursuing Mathematical Subjects. Mathematics, you know, there's some things you just pass. You just pass, right? And there's some things you enjoy. So I enjoyed this subject when I started studying mathematics. And then uh, the skills that math will help you develop is should you focus in math, uh, what are the career prospects? And I'm, I'm sorry that we're all speaking from the academia this morning, but it doesn't mean you have to end up with a ladder if you study mathematics. Okay, there's several other things you can do with your life without ending up with like one of us. Okay, you can do better things than we are doing. You need to be. Um, yeah, sorry. Uh, what are the courses that you can study? What are the applications? Uh, what are the admission requirements? Because I believe a lot of you are going to be aspiring to join us after today. So I'm also talking about the admission requirements. And then some of the challenges. The mathematics matters. I'm sorry, to also say that I think the VIP is passing around some sheets of paper. If you have any questions while I speak, just put them down and pass it down to them. At the end of my talk, then you can take your questions, okay? Mathematics uh, does matter. It is the backbone behind every day, everything in life. If you look at yourself, the beauty of God's creation in you, your body symmetry, you know there's so many things about you that is mathematical. Do you know that? Do you know your, the bone in your head? You know, the bone there, right? It has to have a particular size, everything about you. When you put when you measure the size of your foot, it is the same as the distance from your wrist to your elbow. Do you know about these body symmetries? If you stretch out your hand, your height is from this fingertip to the other fingertip. So even God himself is a mathematician. You are good with me, right? Good. So the math is everything. All things in nature, including you. You are the kind right mathematically. Everything, including you, will come mathematically. Everything turns into mathematics. Now when you're coming to your lessons from your school, you came at a certain speed, right? Isn't it? And you come at some distance and there was a time function involved in it. Is it not mathematics? It is. And you're seated in a way that the person behind you can see above your head. So you're seat at a particular level below the one behind you. That's mathematical precision. Don't you think so? Yes. Miss Ekuya Efriye Ade also gave a presentation. So, what I mentioned two characteristics of living things 
This is where you answer it. All right? Okay. Right. The same is for all. They are all like that. Now, when you are studying, use mnemonics. Now, when I was in school, I was a science student. I was a biology student. Now, what we used to do is name each other. Some, for example, characteristics of a member. Eh? So you are a member. Because you are a member, we will give you all the characteristics as if you are insulting. But we are using that to name. Use what you call mnemonics. Mnemonics and acronym. You know, like acronyms. So remember the SMART. S stands for S. Use that in your study. And then, as I've already said, relate the material meaningfully. And you have to know who you are and find what works best for you. And the most important thing is to what? Have a target for yourself and have a plan as to how to achieve that target. Thank you very much. NIIT were the main sponsors of the program. There was a forum for questions and answers. The quiz competition came up after the seminar. The schools that took part in the quiz were St. Louis Senior High School, T.I. Amadia, Kumasi High School, Kumasi Anglican and Ejisu Senior High School. T.I. Amadia emerged winner at the end of the quiz. Awards were presented to the students after the quiz. It was all joy after the symposium. Tech TV interacted with Professor Mrs. Atinuke Olusola Adibanji. Study mathematics. I mean, the, the, the world is, is wide. Mathematical sciences cuts across every sphere in life. You, can, you have maths in medicine, you have maths in engineering, you have maths in education, you have maths everywhere. So I believe that if you pursue, if we encourage students, especially girls, to enroll in STEM programs with the science, technology, engineering, and mathematics program, we're going to see a major turnaround. And one of the reasons why you sometimes have this um, math phobia, like you we said in the, in the symposium, is because mathematics is not being taught as a concept. Miss Ekua Efriye also gave some insights about the need to study mathematics. Um, not as difficult as some people see, but what we have to understand is that it's not everybody who is good at mathematics. People have different strengths, people have different abilities. My point is to help harness people's potential so that whatever area that they find themselves, they can, or the society can get the best out of it. It doesn't have to go to the HOD Reverend William Obing Dente also spoke to Tech TV. Yeah, yeah. Thank you very much for your question. I think when it comes to the studies of mathematics, it boils down to the one who is taking you through everything that you need, the basics that you need to understand in mathematics. And so I'll use this opportunity also to urge our primary, senior, high school teachers as well, DHS as well to bring the subject down to earth, to explain it in a way that the students will really understand, not intimidating them. 
I'll be able to do that and allow the children to develop their you know, passion in mathematics. They'll be able to come out with flying colors and appreciate the usage of mathematics and even carry it on into the university. So it is not a subject that must be feared. It is a subject that must be embraced. But I want to use this platform to encourage the teachers to also encourage the children. Don't go to class fuming over the children as if they are useless. No. Once we develop them, they'll be able to understand and then get to where we are and even move on. Tech TV, experience educational television.